After announcing that he would step down from his role as Managing Director of Oil Search Limited, Peter Botton spoke to MTV News on his time at the oil and gas company. From the outset, acknowledging the people who stood by him to ensure the success of oil search from a $200 million company to a now over $11 billion company trading on the Australian and PNG stock exchanges. According to Mr. Botton, one thing has stood out, relationships built with people across Papua New Guinea. Uh, look, there have been so many highlights, uh, frankly. Um, I, I suppose the, the one that stands out always, always uh, are the people. Uh, and um, I, I, the people have just been outstanding, both in oil search with a, just a tremendous team and a loyal team that, that share our vision of not just delivering value for shareholders, but also endeavouring to be a part of the social fabric of the country, to contribute to the development of the country, as we've tried to do. Um, but but it's everywhere you go, it's the people. It doesn't matter whether you're in, uh, in Koraba, in, in Hela province, or or in Mendi, or in Kudabu, or in Moran, uh, or in Moresby. It, everywhere you go, the people are the outstanding, and they're the memories. They're the, they're, the thing, they're the thing that gets you up in the morning and says, I come to work to actually do something, and I can make a difference to a, a group of people's lives. Whilst his achievements in building up oil search to be an industry leader in the oil and gas space cannot be denied, Botton says what is most rewarding has been the impact of initiatives he has been a part of in improving the lives of Papua New Guineans. More so for people around oil search's project sites who benefit from programs run by Oil Search Foundation. This in addition to his efforts as chairman of the Hela Provincial Health Authority. Just to be able to play a small role in, in helping and coordinating and doing that with government and other NGOs uh, was, a, was a highlight. And there are so many more. I mean, I think the biggest thing for, for us as an organisation right now is is trying to engage the youth of the country. 68% of the people in the Moran area are under 20. And if you don't engage them properly and you don't give them a, a good life and you train them and you, they, they have a future, um, you, you won't have a business in 20 years' time. So, Botton adding that the future remains bright for oil search and Papua New Guinea, a country that he has come to love over his time in association with Oil Search Limited. Um, but we've always tried to, to firstly sell PNG as a great investment place, and I think our track record over many years has demonstrated that. I, I think in many places around the world, if you talk about Papua New Guinea, they'll talk about all searches. And we're, the, we're the ones that have been out there at the forefront. Much, much easier now with PNG LNG and Papua LNG, but with the big players, Total and Exxon. But it, 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 was, it started from small beginnings.